Hello, my name is Jimmy Rogers with the Tom George Yacht Group. Today we are aboard the 2012 San Lorenzo SL72 Grand Central. Come on aboard with me. Let's take a closer look. This beautiful yacht was imported to the United States by San Lorenzo to cater to the needs of a discerning yachtsman, someone that values true quality and excellence beyond the industry standard. Built as a 2012 model year and featuring U.S. power specifications, Grand Central was custom outfitted top to bottom by famed designer Marty Lowe to exude a zen-like, casual, and open atmosphere throughout. The exterior of the SL72 is constructed in true San Lorenzo form to have a bold, striking, and timeless appeal. The high gunnels all around the perimeter of the main deck give her a serious mega yacht look, accented by beautiful natural teak and heavy duty stainless steel rails. The transom features a large hydraulic swim platform with teak inlay and chalks for a dinghy. Access to the crew quarters and engine room is in the center of the transom with a pantograph door. Antique inlay steps up to the aft deck are both port and starboard. The aft deck has a unique layout with oversized lounge sofa facing aft for the premier view with additional chairs for seating up to eight people. The flybridge overhang above with recessed lighting provides plenty of shade and the natural teak throughout envelops those aboard in a rich yet casual atmosphere. Storage is in the transom and heavy duty stainless steel caps and winches with hose pipes are port and starboard for mooring. For easy access there are boarding doors both port and starboard in the gunnels. The aft deck, salon and dining area blend together effortlessly into one open and spacious environment, blurring the line between the indoors and outdoors with a contemporary beach casual vibe punctuated by the finest of materials and impeccable detail. The salon features an oversized textured white linen slip cover sofa to starboard with hand stitched leather ottoman and end table. To port is a bank of cabinetry with back painted glass doors featuring high end hinges found throughout the vessel on all doors and cabinets. In the cabinetry is abundant storage and a refrigerator as well as pop up Samsung TV with Direct TV satellite television, Apple TV, and a five speaker surround sound system recessed in the ceiling. The dining area features large U-shaped leather seating around a foldable washed teak table that electrically raises and lowers to transition from a coffee table into a full-sized dining table. To port is a storage cabinet for dishware. The galley is placed directly forward of the dining area and features a full array of premium appliances. Miele induction cooktop with overhead range, Miele oven, Sub-Zero refrigerator and freezer, Sub-Zero ice maker, two basin sink with garbage disposal, and an abundance of storage throughout. The galley goes the full beam of the interior space with a buffet area to port and the majority of the galley to starboard. If privacy is required, a partition electrically raises up to separate the galley from the dining area. The pilot house of the SL72 is unique in this size range for its spaciousness around the helm area. There is ample standing room for the captain and two chairs that fold out of the way when not in use. Dual Raymarine chart plotters and a complete digital vessel diagnostic system are prominently displayed front and center. To port of the helm is a spacious lounge area with dinette table. The full beam master suite features a king bed, port and starboard storage drawers, walk-in closet, and a floor to ceiling mirror that has a hidden TV within. Six custom oversized oval windows allow a great amount of natural light in for an open and airy feel. The master head has a very contemporary feel with faucets that come directly out of the mirror and flow into a large singular basin sink. There are his and hers clothes hooks and towel racks in front of a large shower with glass frame and rain head. The VIP suite features a queen size walk around berth with storage port and starboard and an ample sized hanging locker. There is a floor to ceiling mirror here as well with hidden TV behind it and access to the end suite head to starboard. VIP head is also spacious with a large basin sink and glass framed walk-in shower with rain head. 
The additional two guest suites both feature side-by-side -side twin berths in their own end suite heads with basin sinks and walk-in glass framed showers also with rain heads. The lower companionway also features a utility closet with abundant storage and a Miele stacked washer and dryer unit. The Flybridge is the ultimate outdoor lounge area, having been customized for maximum comfort and volume on this SL72 Americas Edition. The app section is dedicated to a large chaise lounge sofa with movable backrest depending on your desired seating. A huge U-shaped sofa with matching end tables and coffee table are juxtaposed with an entertainment center featuring a refrigerator, grill, sink, and a TV all-in-one. Overhead is a heavy-duty bimini top that electronically extends and retracts as desired for sun or shade. The Flybridge Helm area features a forward-facing lounge seat to port and command center to starboard with double bench seat and expansive helm console. Back on the main deck, access to the bow can be made from multiple points. The aft deck has port and starboard walkarounds that are wide enough to feel comfortable and high enough gunnels to feel safe. Access can also be made by pilot house doors, port and starboard, forward in the main cabin. The bow is a scene of beautiful handcrafted stainless steel windlass hardware and natural wash teak flooring. Directly in front of the windshield is a huge sun pad for laying out and soaking in the sun. Additionally, there are twin pantograph doors port and starboard with plenty of storage underneath the sun pad area. Upon accessing the crew quarters from the transom, you will see the crossed over under bunks to starboard and a crew head to port. Further forward is the engine room. Grand Central is being offered for sale by her original owner who is keen to move up to a larger vessel. She has an overall length of 75 feet, beam of 18 and a half feet, and is powered by twin common rail man 1400 engines with very low hours. She is equipped with zero speed stabilizers for the ultimate in comfort, both at rest and underway, providing a solid and stable yachting experience. If you are looking for a yacht that is a cut above the rest in all aspects, a departure from the accepted standards of others, true excellence in quality, design, and functionality, the San Lorenzo SL72 Grand Central is the yacht for you. My name is Jimmy Rogers with the Tom George Yacht Group. Thank you for viewing this presentation. Please feel free to contact me with any questions or if you would like to set up your own private viewing.